Has Kids Chat gotten better or worse? Over a year ago, I made a video diving into the website kidschat.net. I got the idea from the channel Nexpo. I wanted to check in for myself and see if things had changed since he made his video. Back then it looked like they were at least trying to make it harder to get into the site without actually being a child. I got to thinking about the website again and whether or not things really had changed. I had received comments thanking me for shining light on the matter and some even asked me to keep an eye on things. One specific comment stated that there had been many changes to the website in the two months since I had uploaded the original video, stating that there were 13 mods from around the world. I assume to assure me that at least someone was keeping an eye out at all times, and two admins. Getting back into Kids Chat. Once I got back onto Kids Chat, I realized I had my VPN on. For some reason, the website had banned use of VPNs. If I were knowledgeable and truly wanted to, I would have very little issue finding the IP address of anyone on the website. Once again, I found no attempt at forcing an account or even age verification to enter the site. I made a guest account named Grandma Jojo, aged 79 and was pushed through to the chat site. I immediately noticed a conversation about finding, preventing, and getting rid of predators. It seemed preventing these predators from preying on kids was getting harder and harder the more these predators became aware of new technology. It seemed those speaking on the matter were children themselves. For all I know, these kids could possibly be some of the mods I was told about. It almost appeared to me that the kids using the website were working harder to get rid of these people than those who owned it. Trust Pilot After some research, I was able to find a slightly older Trust Pilot review page for kidschat.net. I was hoping to find some more recent reviews on the matter finding the most recent to be from November 16th, 2022, over a full year since the comment, many changes have been made, was left on my original video. The review goes in depth about how most of the moderators are chosen from the users of Kids Chat, meaning any one of those chosen users might not even be kids. The review continues to say that most of the mods are survivors of this website's issues, who have chosen to stand up and take matters into their own hands. With no training, background, or even age confirmation needed, you could guess how easy it would be to befriend an existing moderator while acting as a child and become a mod. I have seen reviews that claimed they were wrongfully and continuously banned after attempting to become a moderator. If you are to use a certain YouTuber's name, I found no information on which one, you will be immediately banned for spamming. Said YouTuber supposedly has stated that the site was full of predators, and many of the mods mock and even make fun of him. Just about every review I saw warned other kids of the nefarious ways this website works. From private chats being filled with requests to join unsupervised chat sites, blackmail, imagery of children, and cases of child grooming and child abuse. As moderators, the kids who have already been affected by this website are now being tasked to monitor and prevent other children from being abused, groomed, and even sexualized. If you ask me, that definitely doesn't sound like a great idea. At this point, I truly question how anyone can argue that this website is trying to be safe, when it's mainly the users who put the most effort into getting everything done. My Verdict 
With all the things I've personally seen and an overwhelming amount of negative reviews, going as far back as July 18th, 2020, most of which warn about rampant use of the site to groom and find kids for predators. I can only say I will never allow my son to go onto kidschat.net. At least, not without me watching everything that happened on screen. I ask for any parent, grandparent, or even child watching this, please be careful with kidschat.net. Do not give out any private information. Do not follow anyone into an unsupervised chat site. The actual owners of this website seem to have a very clear image in mind with what they want kidschat.net to be. I am not in any way saying you will only find predators on this site. Some reviews were positive and tried to give advice on how to be safer while chatting. I will leave a link to the page so you may find your own conclusion on whether or not you feel this place is safe enough. Let me know if there's anything else you'd like to see come from this channel. Hopefully I don't ever have to go onto kidschat.net ever again.